what we have here is a v2 of the peltier based personal cooling solution and this is a somewhat of an extension of the earlier prototype which i showed you so we have this uh, prototype as it is if you have not seen this video check it out in the i button and what i've done is added one more water block in series and then i have added a single 9 amp peltier module behind this heat sink and this uh, 9 amp uh, pelt module draws somewhere around 7 amps at 12 volts again the video for this measurement can be found over here and this time what i have done is rather than going for uh, this kind of uh, thick amd heat sink so these ones so what i think is uh, perhaps they take a lot of time to cool down due to all the thermal mass because these things might be working as thermal capacitors so what i have done is uh, gone with this kind of slim tower style cpu heat sink which has a bunch of heat pipes and yeah i can see that the thermal transmission on these things is a little bit better so the chill over here can be immediately filled over can immediately be felt over here on the tops as well so it has a better conduction so just a single peltier 9 amp drawing somewhere around 7 amp and what i have today here is uh, the air outlet temperature all right so this thing is dangling in the air it's not touching the heat sink and i can see that most of the youtubers what they do is they stuff this uh, thermal probe inside the heat sink of course the heat sink is going to get colder but you are not going to sit on top of that heat sink right what we need is the air temperature so this is the air temperature got it so the air temperature of this system is uh, 26 degrees celsius it might not sound that impressive but uh, take a look over here and the weather today is absolutely brutal so it is 44 degrees celsius outside as you can read over here and inside the house it might be somewhere around i don't know 33 35 degrees celsius perhaps so this kind of system is uh, providing somewhere around you can say a 10 degree drop in temperature over the ambient and yes i was expecting that the discharge air temperature would be lower than this because when we run a proper air conditioner the air outlet temperature or the air discharge temperature of these things is quite chilly so generally the air outlet temperature is 10 to 15 degrees celsius but what we have here is uh, 25 26 degrees celsius so that is uh, about the v2 of this peltier based diy ac if you can call it that Take care and have a nice day guys.